This will be the last mission for this series. <laughs> See, it looks like a brick. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Live long and prosper, we hope. I don't know flying on that plane. It's definitely not Qantas, because this shit looks like it's going to be crashing. This guy looks like a brick. I mean, what's his face? Cyborg. He does a bit. Turn to bridge. Uh -huh. Depart system. Yes. Some funky looking ships around here, mate. I remember this mission. Yeah, it's going to be It's one of the classics. We're going to finish it off and then we'll be done for the night. Uh, you said we're going to be done when we go to Earth Space Dock. Yeah, but now you've got a new ship, so we have to test this ship. Yeah, but that means we do this mission, then we go to Earth Space Dock. Why don't we just go to Quark's and have a beer? Because I want to start doing things. Well, let's go do this and see how your new ship handles things. This is a base mission, if I remember correctly. Yeah, you have to move from one system to the next. My ship's <sighs> trying to get myself lined up properly with the gym. Play on ship's decloaking, sir. Klingon ships have arrived, Rookie. They're moving to intercept. You're here. As I flew into PGM, I saw Captain Raven of the USS Corvus. Wow. That's just creepy. There's still some distance away. Not anymore, they're not. Boom, 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 boom. Oh crap. Buying the, the, the thing that buying a new ship does. You forgot to bind your new weapons. They all bound into the wrong buttons. <laughs> oh, so we do repeat ourselves constantly. Jesus Christ. That's okay, it's only a bird of prey. Exactly. I just did the sensor analysis. What well, he's doing sensor analysis is analyses while all hell's breaking loose. I probably should have upgraded myself. I thought you did. I upgraded my ship, but I didn't like allocate my skill points. <laughs> wow. Five and four for my aft weapons, eight and nine for my back ones. This is some real finger aerobics. <laughs> wow. Worst statement ever. Almost got him though. Complete assignment. Perform routine maintenance. 
Routine maintenance? You fool are Beam down to the planet. I need to upgrade my uniform a bit. My crew looks very techy and hardcore, and I don't. Not, and I'm the only one who looks right. Well, if you call that looking right. At least I actually look like a Starfleet uniform. So do I. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. It's a star. It's a. F s well, same. it's kind. Of, it's an. Odd it's like a sort of a formal uniform. It's an Odyssey uniform. It just looks too wrong. It's too off. It's not right. Yeah, it looks perfectly fine. It's just a bit modernized and the colors are different i.e. wrong uh, there's no right and wrong in Star Trek anymore J.J. Abrams saw to that stop making me sad <laughs> Seriously, dude? Seriously? I don't fucking believe that. What? My guy, I distributed all the stuff I have. I gave the one guy the fire hydrant. He's standing on the hillside with a gun in one hand and a fire hydrant in the other, spraying smoke at the bloody Klingons. He's trying to put it, put it, he's trying to put out their passionate fires. What the hell? Get that Patak, Wookie. Look out, Wookie. Doesn't he turn into an undine or something now? Him or someone else, yes. Bloody 8472. Well, let's kill some things. Look! Look at him! Shh. Look at all the smoke all over this place. And then Wookie gets attacked. Wookie gets killed. It's okay, your story is fixing me. Sorry for my sorry, um... Oh, that was easy. My Klingon looks better. Yeah. True story. Yes, guy. <laughs> yes, guy with smoke machine attack. <laughs> Look at it. 
<laughs> you gave it to me. I know, it's the weirdest thing ever. He just runs around spraying smoke at everything. Sorry, Klingon baby. But you just don't have what it takes to deal with my crazy. It's like spraying it even when he doesn't have to. <laughs> <laughs> He's adding to the atmosphere. There's just smoke everywhere. He's terraforming. It adds to the atmosphere. It makes the game look that much more dramatic. Well, it is a jungle scene. Jungles are supposed to be all foggy and stuff. Yes. Oh, yes. Well, he's actually doing all right. Scan the area. Beam up. Beam up. Just, he's spraying everything. <laughs> I need an entire crew of people running around with those things. A dramatic smoke fog machine thing. Right then, you bitch. Why then, you un you undying bastard? You don't you die. Yes, I know our shields are going down, darling. This this thing's a son of a bitch to fight. This is a long-term episode, Star Trek. Ow. Looks pretty though up here. USS Kirk has arrived. Hit him in the rear, Wookie. His rear is exposed. Yeah, we're doing some nice damage now, eh? Reinforcements helping us as well. Yep. I reckon we could have taken him by ourselves. It just would have taken two hours. Yeah. He wasn't hurting us. We were just not hurting him back either. He was hurting me. Those bloody torpedoes of his. Nasty. At least now I have torpedoes to the back as well. Yep. Good having those. Gotcha, you bastard. And I got a new bridge which looks pretty sweet. Day. We've done it again. What a victory. How much we've changed. Well, new ship, eh? We've done <laughs> nicely there. Oh, I get a reward. Quantum torpedo launch. <laughs> yeah, I saw that too. I'm a happy go lucky lad.
And I'm halfway to level 11. It's nice. Oh, lovely. Hello, Trixie. God damn, life is good with a decent weapon. <laughs> Fat Hobbit. Thanks for watching, folks. We'll see you in a few seconds.